we're gonna talk about what type of patterns we see. Let's do that. All right, here, here this is what a ladder is. Where is it? I think it's right here. That is a ladder. That They look like ladders. This is what a ladder looks like, ladies and gentlemen. Basically, a set of notes going down with the highest one preceding it. That's one way of tapping it. This is how I learned. Yeah, if you want a good custom song to practice this, UFO by Schmutz is a good one. If you want like a DLC song to practice this with, this appears in Devil and Down to Georgia, Victory Solo K. All right, I, I'm pretty sure it's Victory Solo K. That was the one that everybody played. See? Th that's ladders right there. I, I actually never learned how to alt tap this. I've always done it like uh, one handed right here. It was something like that. Also, I will teach you about chimneys. Yes. Chimneys. All right. So <laughs> I've been wanting to uh, I've been wanting to um, explain this for a while now. So, ladies and gentlemen, do you know why it's called a chimney? People who don't know what chimneys are, do you know why it's called a chimney? Because look. Look at this. Look at the house. Look at the chimney. Look, that's the yellow. And then here's the green, red, yellow. Red, green. See? Chimney. That's a house. Bro. Isn't that fucking crazy? I didn't I, I didn't know this until like I actually sat down and I was like, wow, that really does look like a house. Yes, I'm dead fucking serious. This is why it's called a chimney. This is why the pattern is called a chimney. Is because that is the chimney and this is the house. But the yellow should be the simultaneous for the first green. Ah, but that's where that's where we get into reverse chimneys. So it takes this idea of um of the chimney and it just fucking flips it around. Oh, that was a sneeze. Yes, that was the sneeze I had for like half an hour. Oh my god. Yes. Yes, you can use wired Xbox drums on GH World Tour PS2. Yes, um, Solus 3 does have reverse chimneys. There, see, it's literally called reverse chimney solo. See? Reverse chimneys. I love I fucking love this section. But yeah, but once again, it's still that idea of a house with a chimney. Still the same idea, both in uh, both like normally and then in reverse. I mean, technically they are, they are both just chimneys. So zigzags are also another uh, another pattern that that should be self-explanatory. Right here, these are fucking zigzags. Thank you, homie. We'll suck wiener with that one dollar. Thank you, man. See, those are zigzags. See that? See that? Basically, the way you hit this, 
is you get used to rolling your fingers in a motion in such a way. I, I guess, like, you know, the first time I've ever seen zigzags like this was uh, in Freebird on GH2. It's the first time I've ever seen it. Here, Solo C? And then the slower zigzags after this. Uh, a good song to also practice zigzags is obviously zigzag test. Obviously, this is a this is a pretty good one. This is even easier than Zigman. But yeah, you're very very much getting used to the motion of rolling your fingers on the red and yellow buttons. How do you instantly reset the speed to 100? By pressing yellow. Here it is at 30%. Yeah! Yo, 11 months. Hell yeah. months, bro. you're just throwing you're making the motion of like just tossing your fingers index then or finger one then finger two i don't know if you guys would like start tapping like this but yeah it's basically like a quick finger one then finger two yeah and i'm still doing the same thing with my left hand all right i'm still doing the same thing which is just Finger one, finger two, and then let go. Finger one, finger two, then let go. Make sure to keep that red still held down after you tap finger two. Are zigzags spammable? Yes. Another one that's good for practicing is basically this version of the chart the closer over chart. It's called under chart or it's it's called under chart on my game because I downloaded the original chart, but it's called over chart on chorus. This one you could practice your triplets. 
quadruplets. Ascending triplets. Ascending quadruplets. And you can also uh, practice um, chimneys here too. And then your reverse chimneys too. And then whatever the fuck this is. This section right here, you're, you're Chad if you uh, hold down the green. The Chad method is holding down the green. Boom. Chad. Chad. One more time. One more Chad. One more Chad. There we go. Castles? What the fuck are castles? Who the fuck calls them castles? Those are trills. So check this out, dude. Yeah! This... This is... You guys like memes, right? I, I was never aware of the fact that it was called castles, but... Alright. But I guess they're castles now. But, yeah, it, those are trills. Oh, God, how can I explain this? I, oh, God, I am doing, I am sliding from red to yellow. Wait. Does that make any sense? It's so fucked. Does that method work for the beginning of the solo of Solus 3? If you want to if you want to hurt yourself then yeah, you'll do that. I recommend the pattern songs just to learn a lot of these, dude. Like, there are ladders, there are zigzags, there's fucking triplets, everything, dude. And my bag is like an FC double and down droid, but not even S-less one. I, if you're happy with your FCs, man, be happy with how you are, how you're good at the game. Don't be like, oh, am I good, am I, am I good because I get FC shit fuck seven, but I, I can't play through the fire and flame. Just be happy. Be happy. You're decently good at the game if you can fucking FC Devil and Down Georgia. You are pretty good at this game. Shit fuck seven. <laughs> but yeah, basically ghosting is kind of like uh, a step below spamming. This is what ghosting is. This is what spamming is. So there's there's kind of a difference between both of them. But yeah, ghosting. Ghosting is like you see how like my the the blue and the yellow is, and the red is, is lighting up right there. Here's another example of ghosting, and I remember seeing this way back then. It's right here. Yeah, ghosting is sort of like hitting one or two, two more notes than uh, than you really need to. Ghosting isn't really that bad. I don't think ghosting is that bad. I think spamming is a little overboard. Yeah, so it's like hitting all five notes when the run is only like four or whatever. Yeah, and the game still like kind of lets you get away with it. But 
Spamming, I mean, obviously it is extreme, but you, you won't really find people doing this. You won't find pe a lot of people doing this. You won't. See, and then the game acts like that, uh, that's supposed to be honorable because I, I, I hit all the notes, right? I did. I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and just discuss for like the longest amount of time what makes and what doesn't make an honorable FC because chances are if you play this game a lot then you will know if it's like sort of honorable or or not I mean because that's why people come up with methods to hit all these weird tapping parts and stuff like that but honestly it's it's hard to tell it's hard to sort of judge this sort of thing I don't think yeah if, if you hit all the notes it's an FC it is but, you know, it, it's another conversation when you, you hit the section like this, you know? Like, if you go to your friends, you're like, Yo, man, I have seen fucking, I have seen fucking Hangar 18, guys. First time, my, my first time I've seen Hangar 18. And they're like, yo, uh, can I watch the video of your FC? And then they see that. I mean... <laughs> That's up to that's their decision to be like uh I don't know man. I <laughs> There's so many rules and stuff but there's so many weird rules and a lot of like discussion on whether or not an FC is uh ethical. I I don't I don't even know if that's like the right word. <laughs> Honorable. Cuz like you're spamming shit all the time then are you really are you really playing the game or are you just kind of like, are you kind of just guessing so you can say you got a really good FC? But obviously it is a technique too. Yeah, that, that basically covers pretty much every single, every single like consistent, consistent pattern. I don't think there's like any that I really missed. This shit is still funny. Yeah, if you want some real memeage random days, then you do it. You do this. Hold on. How long are you? How? How Lucy lingerie you streaming for? I'm sorry. That better be like that. Better be like some text to or speech to text. How Lucy lingerie you streaming for? Huh? <laughs> if, if all you if all you play is shit like uh like this, if this is what you do all day, you're not you're not gonna enjoy playing other. You're not gonna enjoy playing other other Guitar Hero games, you know. There's so much more to this game than this, man. There's so much more. There's so much more, man. The whole game isn't about this. And there's people who sit down for eight hours, like eight, nine hours a day playing that. And no wonder they want to fucking hurt themselves. No wonder they want to die. I would too if I played this stuff all the time. I don't know. I can't, I can't change what you want to play in this game. It's just like, if you sit down and you play that all day, it's like, go play Step Mania. That's cool, too. That's a cool game.